What's up guys, this is SG413 and welcome back to another unboxing video. So for today what we got are uh, these three. So we have two RS3Ms. This is the V5 with UV and the robot. Uh, and then this is the RS3M 2020 with UV and cubicle pro shop loop service. And then this right here is a Guhong Pro uh, with maglev and this is 54 millimeters i own a 56 millimeter one uh which is one of my favorite puzzles just because of the way it turns i love how it feels and i feel pretty good about this one so i'll set that there and actually let's start off with the 54 millimeter guhan pro so i'm quite excited about this. Um, I don't think I own a 54 millimeter. Well, actually, no, that's not true. The Guhong V3M is 54 millimeters. I believe so. And yeah, let's take a look at this. That's the same stuff. Yep. Nothing too fancy and here's the puzzle oh yeah it is definitely so there's nothing else to it these boxes are always awesome so let's go through this okay so just like the 56 millimeter one it is very greasy on the outside um actually gonna wipe that down a little bit okay now that should be good um, I'm gonna set this aside for now and focus on this so overall does seem pretty similar obviously uh, definitely feel I like the feeling of it I think it um, I definitely do like the feeling of 54 in my hands it's quite pleasant, but let's go ahead and do some first turns. Also feels really nice. I can say this is. It's gonna do some potential. I also really suck at one-handed, so I'm not even gonna try. But for my first impressions, this feels really nice. Basically, feels exactly the same, uh, and I wanted to get this just because it's a little smaller, and I do like, I definitely do like the feeling of 54 millimeter cubes, but this could be, I could actually have some pretty decent times with it. I'll have to do some saws on this, so I definitely see a lot of potential in it. So next up, because this wants to open on me, I'm going to do the SARS 3M2020. Uh, this is in UV and with the typical loop service. Alright. Oh yeah, this is really gummed up. But, I mean, that's pretty typical. So, of course, this is going to be really slow out of blocks, probably, but let's do some turns. Yep. Cubes with a uh, pro shop wave service are always very slow, but that's just because they're really chalked up with lube and, they, and you have to take time for it to break in. But 
Wow. I mean, I definitely do like the UV uh, quite a bit, actually. Um, where are the settings on? Uh, low, so I'll have to play around with the tensions a little bit. Okay, it's breaking in a little bit, so that's a positive. So yeah, that's, I mean, I do see a lot of potential, but make it some pretty good times with it. So yeah, that's it for this RS3M. I definitely really like how it feels. So, yeah. Other than that, we'll move on to what I'm most excited for. And that is the RS3M V5. So, ever since I heard about this, I was just like, I really want to try this for myself. And I also really like uh, the robot stand that I saw. So, that's basically why I wanted to get it. I'm going to rip off this plastic off camera because, as you may already tell, I'm struggling with it. <laughs> uh, there we go. Let's see this awesomeness. Oh, that is so awesome. Oops. These are just tension tools. Pretty basic. Oh my god, I love this. So then... Let's seal it up with these. Ah, come on. Nice. So then that pops off, and there we go. It's so cute. <laughs> so obviously by the teal internals, you, ob you obviously know what version this is. It's the Maglev Ballcore UV. So, let's do some first turns. Okay, wow. I may be locking up a little bit, but I mean, I'm liking the feeling of this right now. It's a little dry right now, but I mean, I'll just have to do some setup with this because this is really, really fast for being dry right now. Yeah, basically on all three of these, all the three of the puzzles I got today, I'm going to have to do some cells on them, because I'm curious to know how I'll do on them. But, let's see if I can take a look at the mechanism real quick. There we go. I don't really see a massive difference. Let's look at a corner. Nope, there we go. Yeah, I don't necessarily, it's not focusing, come on. Yeah, I don't really see a massive difference. I was going for it. Yeah, I'm definitely liking this so far. I think I'll have a great time solving on this. Actually, pretty much on all three of these, I have a pretty good shot at. So, let's put the that, that logo. There we go. Alright, so, basically, these are the three puzzles I got. I also did get some more stuff, too, actually. And, um, also another thing I forgot to mention about the accessories box that was in here, but, I mean, 
This is literally it literally is the same stuff, so that doesn't matter at this point. But that's not the only thing. So let's move these aside for now. And I got two Halloween stuff or two Halloween cards or whatever from the cubicle. Pretty awesome. And then I got this sticker. Rest in pieces. And then I got some Easy Rush. This is uh, one of the lubricants I wanted to try out. And yeah. So basically, put these back actually. And yeah, this is what I got for today. Let's add these as well because they need to be included in this. Wow, nice going. <laughs> There we go. Now that looks good. So, yeah, this is basically what I got today. Please be sure to like, share, comment, subscribe. It really helps me out a lot. And turn on my notification bell as well. And with that being said, I shoot you one three. Signing out.